50 excel formulas in 50 days so day 38 today we are going to combine two tables but the order of the columns doesn't match so here i have got table 1 with first name last name and email in that order and the second table has email first name and last name now we want to combine both of these tables and get one big table if i simply use v stack which is a vertical stacking formula and select the first table comma second table as the order doesn't match we will get wrong value so we will see the first names here but then very soon we start to see the email address so that's the problem and here is how we would do it we are going to use the let function again and let and we are going to start by declaring two variables table 1 which points to this entire data set and table 2 and then we are going to create another variable called header which is nothing but the first row of the table 1 which contains the headers the way that we want so for this we are going to use the take function take table 1 comma row 1 as the header so now that we know what header we want we want to rearrange the table 2 to match the order of the headers in the table 1 and for this we are going to have another variable called table2 underscore header and this is nothing but take table2 comma 1 so so far this header is these rows and this header is that those three cells so now that all of the headers are there we just want to rearrange table2 so this can be another variable called table2 underscore order we're going to say x match x match header in table2 header so now that those are there we are going to combine everything this can be another variable called combine table and this is nothing but v stack of header and then drop table1 one so everything in table1 except the very first row first row will come from the header variable and then drop table 2 one everything in table 2 except the header now when you are picking these we need to rearrange them as per the table 2 order so this is where once we dropped we are going to send this to choose calls function take the dropped thing and then rearrange them using the table 2 order that we calculated close all these brackets and hit enter and here is our combined table you can see that now here i have got the second table bar for any and their email address and everything how cool is this